Digital Green organizes rural communities to share knowledge on improved agricultural practices, livelihoods, health, and nutrition using locally produced videos and human-mediated dissemination. These videos provide a valuable resource, empowering social workers with better tools, farmers with better practices, and community members with the power to learn from each other. Traditional extension systems face a challenge in the sheer number and remoteness of the households they serve, and existing communication tools have been simply inadequate. The use of video can increase the reach of targeted information and maximize the impact of social workers. At Digital Green, we partner with existing development efforts that are already working with rural communities. We train four to six people from the community to produce short videos that are essentially by the community, featuring their testimonials, their experiences, demonstrating practices to their peers, and then have these videos shared amongst the community using mobile projectors that are in the hands of frontline workers who are members of the very same villages in which they share these videos. Digital Green's approach, combining technology and social organization, has been shown in a controlled evaluation to be 10 times more cost effective and uptake of new practices seven times higher compared to the traditional extension system. Videos are produced by the communities themselves. They feature community members demonstrating their experiences with locally relevant practices. By seeing a technique work for their neighbor, others find assurance that it can work for them as well. Community members edit the footage into 10-minute videos and add them to the library on the Digital Green website. You can browse this database by video topics, locations, languages, and more. Video screenings are organized weekly. They are facilitated by a member of the community using battery-powered projectors and speakers. These events provide community members with the opportunity to share experiences and examine new ideas with similar people. Oftentimes, seeing is believing. At Digital Green, learning and reflection forms the basis of future work, and there is a strong emphasis laid on evidence. At each screening, data is collected, including farmers present, videos screened, questions asked, and adoptions of new practices. Near real-time data is reported and analyzed on COCO and Mobile COCO, a data management software which can be used in areas with limited power supply and connectivity. Data collected on the ground informs the next generation of videos in an iterative process that continually addresses the needs and interests of the community. Digital Green is applying lessons first learned in India to projects throughout South Asia and Sub-Saharan Africa, and to diverse areas including health, nutrition, and agriculture. We're running various types of evaluations using tools like randomized control trials to see how do the practices translate into changes in socioeconomic status, health impacts, and quality of life, which is what we're seeking to ultimately achieve. This is an approach that should improve the well-being of the community and we should be open to adapting the model, to contextualize the model in different geographies, in different domains, to the extent it is possible. I can say that first of all, we are trying to ensure that the effect is coming from the first of all. The things we have अपने मुंह से पहुंचाते थे कम्युनिटी तक अब हम वीडियो के थ्रू पहुंचा रहे हैं जो चीजें हम उनको साइंटिफिकली दिखाना चाहते थे वो सामने वो वीडियो पे देख रहे हैं स्क्रीन पे देख रहे हैं तो वो ऑफ कोर्स वो उन तक ज़्यादा बेनिफिट कर रहा है तो एक तरह से हमारे लिए बहुत ही ज़्यादा बड़ा अचीवमे� वीडियो हो गया तो सब दीदी खेती कर पाती है कि वीडियो देखने से समझ पा पा जाती है और पढ़ो दीदी है वो भी समझ पाती है उपाय होने से तो ज़्यादा फायदा है इसलिए कि आगे की काम कार्य में अधिक लाभ होता है पैसा रहने पर हर काम है बच्चा की पढ़ाई लिखाई है या आगे कोई काम है आगे की विकास हो रही है
The Digital Green Approach is empowering rural communities to share their knowledge and know-how with each other. It is increasing the efficiency of social workers and improving the health, livelihoods, and well-being of rural people